And now we are doing exercise 13.1 question number five. Question number five. Let me write down the question. Question says when. Here is your question given. Question says find the when the angle of a triangles are measured in sexagesimal system. So there is a triangle. Okay. Let us name it as A B C. Okay. So let me just write down. Let triangle let a b c be the triangle let a b c be the triangle right where angle a is equal to 2 there right so let me write down 2x angle b is equal to 3 is there so write down 3x and angle c angle c is equal to 4x so angle a is 2x this is 3x and this is 4x now we know what do we know we know that angle a plus angle b plus angle c a plus angle b plus angle c is equal to 180 degree sum of the angle of a triangle is 180 degrees so it will be 2x plus 3x plus 4x is equal to 180 degree 3 4 5 5 plus 4 9 x is equal to 180 degree and x is equal to 180 divided by 9 9 to the 18 it will be 20 degree okay so we got x as 20 degree so therefore therefore angle a is equal to angle a is 2x right so 2x so 2x which will be equal to 2 into x we got as 20 so 20 degree into 20 2 20 into 2 it will be 40 degree right and 40 degree the question is asking us to convert it into radians so angle a is equal to 40 degree is equal to 40 into pi by 180 formula for converting it to radian so 0 0 out 2 to the 4 or 4 and the 2 to the 4 yeah okay 2 to the 4 to 9 the 18 and it is 2 pi by 9 which will be equal to 2 pi by 9 radian right angle b which will be equal to 3x which will be equal to angle b is 3x right so yeah so angle b is 3x which will be equal to 3 into 20 which will be 3 to the 6 it is 60 degree angle b is equal to 60 degree so convert 60 degree is into radian so 60 into pi by 180 0 0 out 6 1 the 6 6 3 the 18 and it is pi by 3 and radian so which will be pi by 3 and radian right so it is pi by 3 radian therefore now let us see angle c which will be 4x and x so we know we have found out x to be 20 so 4 to the 8 it will be 80 degree so angle c is equal to 80 degree convert this into radian so 80 into pi by 180 and it is radian which will be 0 0 out 4 to the 8 2 for the 8 and 2 9 the 18 4 pi by 9 so 4 pi by 9 in terms of radian okay so that's all i think pretty much i have done all these things correctly if you find any difficulties please feel free to write down in the comment below thank you so much we will meet in the next video